So this is going to be our last sample question from section 6.2. Again, the directions still have not changed. So you're going to have to check to see if there's a GCF first, and then let's see if we have to do grouping method. So let's check. Remember, we're always looking to see if there's a GCF first. So you gotta remember, check for GCF. Go through A for D, A, do we have the same parentheses? No. B, do we have the same letter in every term? No. C, do we have the same number in every term? Numbers, numbers, no numbers, no. D, does it start as a negative? No, so no GCF. Next, count the number of terms. One, two, three. You know three terms with no leading coefficient, no number in front. Shortcut. So let's try a shortcut. And if you forgot a shortcut, two sets of parentheses is your setup. Step one, break up the leading term p squared as p and p. Step two, sign issues. Remember, this is a plus sign. So that tells me same sign. So these two binomials have to have the same sign. Now that either means two pluses or two minuses. It could be two pluses or it could be two minuses. You have to look at the middle to determine what type. Anytime it's same. Since it's a minus, haha. -ha. Minus, minus. Step three, do all the combos of the last item. So all the combos of 100, 1 and 100, 2 and 50, 4 and 25. Notice I skipped 3 because it doesn't go in there evenly. 5 and 20, 6, nope, 7, nope, 8, no, 9, no, 10. Haha, -ha, notice. Remember, when we get doubles, you're done. I don't have to check 11, 12, 13, because this is a repeat. So I have five combos to check from. Remember, once we get our list, which was step three, step four, we're gonna either add or subtract the list. Because this is a plus, we're gonna add. So we got 101, 52, 29, 25, 20. Step five, choose a combo. 15, uh-oh, there's no 15. Remember, we double check. We knew I had to add my combos. I knew I got all my combos down. There was no GCF. If you can't find a combo that matches, can't factor it out GCF, cannot factor out shortcut because there's no combo that matches, then our answer is gonna be prime. Remember, there will be occasions where you might not get a combo that matches. If you can't find a GCF, just say it's prime.